hello everyone welcome to my channel if you haven't subscribed go ahead and hit the subscribe button so today when I uh, start taking my uh, scooter out for a ride and I start noticing it's have a problem so as you can see every time if I switched uh, the key to the on position as you can see the uh, gas meter and everything should be turned on right that's including the light on the front, the headlight, it's turned on, right? But the problem here is, if I turn the steering wheel all the way to the left, like, like when you lock the, the scoot up, um, as you can see right here, see the meter and all the light, Start to go off. See, so and then if I move the um, handlebar back to uh, straight it out, as you can see, the, there's the meter went back on, and the gas meter back on, and all the light turned back on. So, uh, so there's definitely something wrong. Um, or maybe when I turn this way, there's some kind of loose connection uh, on the scooter that costs the meter to go off or cost the power to... Uh... So uh, today we're going to find out uh, and diagnose uh, what the problem is. So let me turn this off. And for my scooter, you remove this screw right here, the screw right here. And then the two screws on the bottom, one, two. And then the middle one right here. And the one on the side right here. So I already took the liberty of uh, removing it. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and, uh, and remove uh, the front. Go ahead and unplug it. So unplug the front and let me lay this down. Now, I want to check if maybe the connection here is loose. Loose. Connection from the, the ignition switch. Maybe it loses costs is to lose power. So let me try to uh, do that again and see if it's doing the same. So turning on, move this all the way to the left. See right now, if I turn it on and move all the way to the left. It's fine, so it don't cause a problem anymore. So there must be something here that causing it. So the same all the way to left. So it's not doing it. So it must be something right here that pinch into it that cost that loops uh, see if I push all the way to the left uh, the connection is good not like before so uh, 
maybe it's something to do with this tie down right here when I turn it uh, it push and make something in a connection is loose so I go ahead and uh, trying to remove this zip tight and then uh, maybe zip tight this cable somewhere over here so we don't have that problem when I turn the steering uh, bar uh, it don't accidentally hang this thing hmm. okay I'll be right back so uh, I did a couple of change to uh, to make sure it uh, doesn't get loose again so the location the tie uh, the zip tie location from here I changed it to over here so you get more wiggling room and I also zip tie the connection right here so it won't come out so those two should make it a lot better if I'm moving the handlebar as you can see it won't interfere it with anything else I'll go ahead and put this cover back cover back right here so it's cover that uh, the connection and um, let me see So now the connection is covered and uh, I get that should work. Uh, let me test it again. So to the, to the left side, I turn it on. As you can see, this power, um, not like before when I do this, this is when the steering is, uh, when the handlebar is all the way to the left, uh, there's no power. So you can see the, the gauge is not going up. So now it does. So let's even fix the problem. I'll go ahead and um, put the the top back in and uh, test it again and uh, see how it go. So after I put the the front back in, uh, so the head. Uh, the handlebar all the way to the left. Turn it on and see if it has power. Now it does have power. Uh, let's do it again. Try and twist the handlebar all the way to the right. Okay, and uh, turn the power on. It does have power. Uh, twist it all the way to the left. Turn the power on. And it does have power. Uh, let me see. Turn it on. It runs. The light in the front, and the light work, all three light work. Go ahead and turn it off. So it seemed like uh, uh, I fixed the problem. So it's probably just, uh, yeah the wrong uh, tight location the zip tight location and also uh, that cost when you uh, use the uh, scooter for so long uh, is make a loose connection so we just changed the location of the uh, zip tight 
of that cable from the ignition um, switch to a different location so it's more loosely so uh, when you're doing uh, the head bar or steering it won't affect uh, that cable and won't cause that problem again so that's it uh, I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys on the next video